Hi, my name is Chris Daly, and today I'll be taking you around the Weyerbacher Brewing Company. The process all begins when the grains are put into the masher and heated and cracked and mixed with hot water to produce a wort. To that wort can be added spices, hops, uh, any kind of fruit puree to give the beer a unique flavor. And from the kettle where the wort is made, it is put into a holding tank where the full batch can be created and cooled. From the holding tank, the beer moves into a fermenter where yeast is added and can sit up to two weeks fermenting. After the yeast is harvested from the fermenters, the beer is moved to the bright tank where it is ready for bottling. Moving down the line, the beer bottles are placed onto the conveyor belt and the beer is siphoned from the bright tank into the bottling machine where the beer fills four 12-ounce bottles at a time, which are subsequently capped and labeled and moved down the conveyor belt. Every case of Weyerbacher beer is packed by hand. My job is to take the bottles off of the conveyor belt and put them into the cases. Seal the cases and stamp the expiration date on. Once the bottling is finished or if there is no bottling to be done, uh, I am packing variety packs. It's a lot of fun. The people are great, the product is great, and it's rewarding in its own sense. 